Exercise intensity. In order for a sports performer to make progress and improvements in their training, they have to exercise at an appropriate level of intensity. If they train too hard, they risk injury or developing the incorrect fitness component. And if they don't train hard enough, they'll make little progress towards their goals. There are different methods of assessing how hard a performer has been working. Heart rate is measured in beats per minute. Resting heart rate can give a general impression of an individual's fitness level. A performer with outstanding aerobic endurance will generally have a low resting heart rate. Performers and coaches will track the heart rate to ensure they are working at an appropriate level and are training the correct type of fitness. They will do this by using heart rate training zones. First you need to calculate your maximum heart rate. This is 220 minus your age. You then use this number as your 100% and work out the percentages needed to work out the different target zones. 0 to 50% is the warm up or cool down zone. 50 to 60% is the fat burning zone. 60 to 85% is the aerobic training zone. And 85 to 100% is the anaerobic training zone. Let's do some worked examples. I am 33 years old, so firstly we need to work out the heart rate max, which is 220 minus 33, which equals 187 heart rate max. So if I was training for a marathon and wanted to improve my aerobic fitness, I would have to work between 60 and 80% of my heart rate max. 60 times 187 divided by 100 equals 112 BPM, while 85 times 187 divided by 100 equals 159 BPM. So when I am out training I need to ensure that my heart rate is between 112 to 159 beats per minute. If it is higher or lower then I will not be training the correct system and therefore my training will be unsuccessful. If I was training for more explosive higher intensity sport then I would have to be working between 85 to 100 percent in the anaerobic zone. So I would need to ensure my heart rate is between 159 to 187 beats per minute. The Borg scale of perceived exertion. This is the scale of 6 to 20 that athletes can refer to when asked how hard they have been working during a training session. 6 being no exertion at all and 20 being maximum effort. 12 to 14 is perceived as moderate exercise. This can be linked with heart rate training zones to help determine the intensity of the performer. RPE times 10 equals heart rate which is in beats per minute. So if I was out on a training run and I rated my intensity at 14, that would equate to 140 beats per minute. My aerobic training zone is 112 to 159 beats per minute, so therefore I am working at the correct intensity for improving my aerobic endurance. Today's activity is to do the calculations for yourself and someone else in your family. During the exam you will be expected to work this out for a specific age and determine the intensity for their chosen goal. 